hi guys welcome back to another entertainment news it's your host today sammy too so before we get into all today's update here are the headlines the video take full responsibility of their son Shoma Veroland full isolation daddy please commend the video for his honesty <laughs> So before we get into all today's update, if you're new here, if it's your first time watching me on this YouTube channel, you're welcome. Hit on the red subscribe button below and subscribe and turn on the notification bell. Set it to all so that you'll be notified whenever I drop another interesting video. And also, don't forget to follow me on Instagram with the username you've seen on the screen right now. Tap on the link in the comment section to follow me on Instagram. I follow YouTube back immediately. So without wasting much of your precious time, let's get right back into the video. Nigerian singer David Adeliki has given an update on the current situation of things hours after he made the shocking announcement that his fiancé and mother of his son, David Jr. Ifain, Choma Averoland, been tested positive for the deadly disease coronavirus. Record that the DMW boss on Friday took to his Instagram account to reveal that Choma had been tested positive for the virus, although she showed no symptoms at all, while himself and the baby tested negative. The video shared a cute photo with the son and hero staying strong for mama, three love emoji everywhere good. We wish everyone suffering from the deadly pandemic disease coronavirus a quick recovery. Here's the video and the screenshot of what he posted on his Instagram account. You haven't, you haven't seen so. anything. You <laughs> know, <laughs> <laughs> start pulling your top and doing it. Don't move. Now be careful. 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 Be the baby's mom, Choma Roland, isolation. Let me know what you think about the video being responsible, man, in the comment section. So let's move to other news. Now the third pharmacy where we go go with this, they're not getting nose mask. It doesn't move market for them. So. Nose mask doesn't move market. Let's go to bring from China the same place where this year go rugged do. Media personality that the freezer has react to the report that the video's girlfriend has been tested positive to coronavirus, the deadly pandemic. Reacting to the news that the freezer celebrated the singer for his transparency, then went on to pray for the couple. He wrote, Wow, love your honesty and transparency, David. Something our leader should emulate and imitate. May the healing hand of Yahusha Ah <laughs> be upon her. And Yahweh blessing and mercy be upon our life at this crucial time. This is what he posted on his Instagram account. I mean, may not read with any right. <laughs> I can't pronounce those words, please. <laughs> Next on the news. Controversial Nollywood actress Inke Chiblensi Sunday has taken to her Instagram account to mock slay queens over the recent lockdown due to the coronavirus. According to Inke Chi, slay queens can't take photo again because they are in their real homes, taking care of home before impressing the streets they won't hear. Now it don't happen. She captured. Here's a screenshot from what she posted on her Instagram account. Excuse me, miss. Are you currently dating someone? Yes, but they live in another nation. What nation? My imagination. Next on the news. Hollywood actor Yela Dochi has asked President Buhari to provide economic relief to Nigeria, even if it's 50,000 naira per person. 
He posted this on his Twitter account. Yole Toji post readers, the president at Mbua replaced provide an economic relief package for Nigerians. Even if it's 50,000 naira each, it will go a very long way. People have angry lockdown with no money begging left, right and center. With the situation at hand like this, it will be difficult to keep people at home. He posted and urged the president. You are working with the Ministry of Health on protecting our citizens from COVID-19 virus. As a government, this is now a key priority for us. I therefore enjoin you to ensure that adequate medical provisions and other welfare requirements are afforded. Let's move to other news, guys. What's good, bro? Oh, man. First of all, TS fine. Fuck. Second of all, I'm still the hardest motherfucker out here. Popular Nigeria rapper YC has revealed that the CEO of his former record label, Tiny Entertainment, possessed huge sum of money belonged to him. He made this revelation when a Twitter user asked him to do giveaway in a bid to cushion the effect of the lockdown amid the coronavirus pandemic. The user who took to the comment section of YC tweet said, Baba do giveaway now. However, YC attempted to keep to bear with one stone as he declined by telling the user, to ask his former boss, Tiny. The Jacoban hit make a road. Go ask Tiny. He got all my millions. Here's this screenshot. Come on, see as I see as I find, see as I said. No val I make that no Valentine. Nobody even send me flower or even yeah, even yeah. singlets. Is that a singlet? Or, <laughs> or boxers. YC. But later on I will do oh my god, if I catch YC, YC is my crush. Because this is thunder fire all of Una. Everybody don't post flower. You want to post flower, collect flower, you want to do this or do that, you want to do that or do that. I just hear the wish fine, but we try the use fine boy they do. Nobody fico will say Baby, I'm coming tonight. Wear lingerie, all those things. Make she look sexy for me. Nobody. They are the the the. the I'm gonna go punish all of you now. Anybody who they enjoy Valentine, we never marry. We now go break up. Let's move to other news, guys. Nollywood actress and mother of one Vanessa Njegede has taken to social media to cry out bitterly about the self isolation imposed by the Lagos government over the deadly corona ravaging the world. She took to her Instagram account to say it's getting tough on her and that she can't take it anymore nor cope. She wrote, it's getting tough for me, I can't deal with this anymore. But most importantly, I want to send love to everyone out there. I can't even imagine what other people are going through. I'm looking out the window and praying for a miracle. I feel imprisoned. Not a soul on the street of my estate. It's better to be safe than sorry. Stay safe, stay at home, remember hygiene is paramount. I don't want people to die. I'm I'm so scared. Keep in touch with your friends and family. Here's a screenshot of what she posted. Woke up this morning and tears has revealed to stop streaming down my cheeks. But trust me, I'm not crying. I'm not crying. I'm not even sad. But the tears just keep coming. Thanks for watching, guys. If you find the video interesting, don't forget to hear your opinion in the comment section. And don't forget to tap on the like button. Yeah, tap on the like button if you find the video interesting. And don't forget to hear your opinion in the comment section. Let me know what you think about each of the updates I just covered. And uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, since the moment, take the opportunity to join the community of over 70,000 subscribers. Yeah, so when you click on the red subscribe button below, you just subscribe. And don't forget to turn on the notification bell, set it to all, so that you'll be notified whenever I drop another interesting video. And 
don't forget to follow me on instagram with the username you see on your screen right now like seriously eat it daily eat the this eat the so don't mind my sweating yeah so see you guys in next video peace as always stay safe guys